thought you were a fisherman. No kidding, grab him, bud. Damn, I just don't like catching You can rinse your hands off, it's fun. Ah. back from the store got me a pair of sunglasses for the beach I'm eating right now I got me a cheese sandwich hey dad what'd you get over there got me a cheeseburger oh that's something good so we're gonna eat then we're gonna be on our way to Pensacola Florida yay so what's up guys we are back with another video before we get started, go down there, subscribe, ring the notification bell, and like this video. So today we have we have been we've just been wanting to go to Florida forever since last year. So we have finally made it to this moment. We are at the beautiful beach. Where are we at? We're at Pensacola Beach. That's right. Well, Fix we're to go not, ch check our house out, right? We're basically not on the beach just yet. But we're at our house. Yeah, we just got here. Look at this place, man. It's huge. It has an elevator it, in it's it. It's a good thing we're sharing it with like four families, huh? Yeah. Let's go check it out. Shh. Oh, there's another story. Woo! So exciting. I love the big kitchen. This is our room. I'll be in here if you need me. Out on the deck. The master suite. Holy moly. We can watch some good YouTube on that size TV. <laughs> oh, look. It's right there, Katie. What? The water. Oh. So we're right here. I was confused. Well, Houston, did you find you a bedroom yet? No, let's go see. Gotta go up some more stairs. Where's the elevator at? Yeah, that's a king that's bed. That's the king. That's where the boys will be. Her boy. Got three views. Look at that view. Oh. The pink house that does not match. <laughs> Check out the view on this side. Oh, it's not, it's not like the view over there, but it's pretty. There's a lot you of see the gold from here. Yeah. Houston was like, it's a small pool. Can we get in? Can we get in? Hey, honey. Yep. We've got dual outdoor showers. Perfect. <laughs> You know what that means, right? No, I don't. I don't either, but we have dual outdoor showers. Yeah. Yay! Well, babe, you're home for a week. I am, so glad. It feels so nice. Well, the rest of the crew has arrived now. This is kind of like the National Lampoon's vacation. There is a crew. And we did bring a U-Haul because when we go to Florida, we don't do it lightly. But look at this place. Man, you did good, DJ. Welcome to sunny Pensacola Beach, Florida. I'll be your tour guide for the next week. Don't fall in the water. Don't eat sand fleas. Um, I'll think of some more rules in a little while. Oh, 
Oh, Kobe! You gotta look down. You gotta look down. You might step on that big one. There's one over there. Sure. Little bitty guy. Get on the chase, man. <laughs> boys, y'all gonna let all those crabs go? Go back to the house. Hermit crab. Scoby? Yeah. Your turn next. You get to throw it. <laughs> Think you can do that? Yeah. Yep. Yep. Got one. No, more than one. Not a ton, but it's a start. Those are the croakers? No, they were man -hating. Oh yeah. Oh, the slimy! Just grab it. They won't think that they need it. Ew! Come on, bro. Get them in the bucket. Gross! Don't make Jacoby do it all. Why? Man, I thought you were a fisherman. No kidding. Grab them, bud. I am. I just don't like... You can rinse your hands off, it's fun. Ah. Probably. We got bait. Now you can go catch fish, right? Yeah. So that's right, we are off the coast of Pensacola. We're probably five, six miles out off the coast. I'm not exactly sure. But uh, Houston Jacoby and my wife are with me. It's a little rough today. Everybody else couldn't talk Emily into coming. She didn't want to get out here and get seasick. Couldn't talk Weston into coming. So uh, we brought the two little ones, they're brave. The goal, hopefully, is to get out here and catch some big red snapper and not throw up. Nobody's gonna get seasick, right? No, we got our patches on. Should be good. They got their patches. So uh, we're out here fishing with a friend who I 100% blame for my wife's beach addiction. I've said it for years. That's Brian Ballard. And uh, the first time we ever came to Pensacola was because of a, a benefit fundraiser auction fishing trip that my wife and I bought with a couple friends. And he got her addicted to the beach. It's Brian's fault, 100%. Let's see if he can catch some fish. Come back up here. Let's sit on this. Houston, Houston, back up, buddy. You got to reel it, buddy. Reel. There you go. Reel. Keep going. Now reel, reel, reel. When you go down, reel. Now pull it up. Now reel. When you go down. Keep going. Pull it up. Got him now. Reel it, reel it, reel it. There you go. Oh, that's good. Oh, looky there, bro. There's a snapper. Got a snapper. I think so. Stay right there. So was that right there? Yeah. I'll tell you something. You got to hold that fish way out in front of you to make it look big. What do you think about your first snapper, buddy? Cool. Hey, try to stay in the boat. Quit running around. to be holding on with both hands. I am. It's a little wavy. It's a little red snap. Back up, Toby. <laughs> <laughs> there 
you gotta reel it. You gotta reel it, bud. Strong. All right, you got it. <laughs> Look at there. Little guy, we gotta get a bigger one than that. Oh, there's a bird too. Using a little pet bait, drop it down on the bottom, send it down to Snapperville. Just not taking it. <laughs> I say that they've taken my bait about four times. Just not getting hooked. Well, that was kind of short-lived. What happened? Rainstorm, lightning. Rainstorm right over the horizon, right over her shoulder right there. Too much lightning in it. We're gonna find somewhere else a little farther from the fire bolts of electricity. Kobe? Yeah. He's the only one that caught a keeper fish. Yeah. A little disappointed in you, Houston. You just caught one little dinky one. Hey. Hey, at least I caught one. I'm sorry we didn't get to stay out there and catch a bunch of fish, though. Yeah. Well, that's a disappointing fishing trip. Yeah. I'm telling you, the radar looked great, but there's one pass to get from the intercoastal waterway out into the Gulf here at Pensacola, and the storms are just building right at the pass. But it is what it is it's not brian's fault it's just dangerous when you get out there and lightning and all that it we just didn't want to get caught in storm kind of a bummer we caught one keeper snapper yeah that was it but uh as i said earlier brian does have a really cool program that he does it's called sportsman giving back and has a huge banquet every year we've never got to attend but um we kind of got to know brian really well over a few years every time we come down here we hang out he had a big uh, shrimp, shrimp boil one course. year for us and as I was saying before the battery died Brian has a really cool uh, foundation called Sportsman Giving Back they're on Facebook I'll leave a link to his uh, foundation uh, they have a big banquet every year he's still planning on that banquet this year and uh, the cool thing about this year's banquet is we hooked Brian up with Jimmy Houston and Jimmy's gonna be the speaker so as long as the world doesn't end between now and September, September it's either September or October I don't remember for sure you can check out the dates on uh, on his uh, Facebook page but go check it out Jimmy Houston is going to be the keynote speaker They're, they have a huge meal tons of door prizes a lot of auctions and they raise money for special needs children um, usually they buy like two or three handicap wheelchairs like all-terrain off-road wheelchairs and things for for kids with uh, handicaps so it's an awesome deal so go check that out and uh, I think we're going to head to the beach if we can avoid the rain. Dang, you boys didn't waste your time changing clothes. 